Oh man, sometimes, yeah, you know, you get those sets that you think look cool, but I don't know, you know, you just, I feel like some of these Overwatch sets, guys, just don't have the pop like they used to. Do you guys agree? I don't know. Anyways, Fox here with Xbox Games. And you know, I was going over some of my Legos and, and I was trying to put up some of the ones that we've done reviews on. And you know, we're, I was thinking, okay, we put them in a box and kind of forgot about them. And most sets I don't forget about. You know, a lot of the smaller sets like the uh, the little spinners here from Ninja Ninjago, it's like, you know, these just hang around. You know, you, you remember these things, but this particular one, especially the kind of the whole Overwatch series, um, I don't know, I feel like it was kind of a flop. Like they came out, they were cool. But with bigger games like, you know, like Fortnite and a bunch of those, it's, you know, this. I feel like this kind of got overshadowed. I am definitely waiting for, you know it, Fortnite Lego. So for all you guys out there who can, you know, get those tips way quicker than me, yeah, post something in the description. I would, uh, man, I want to go check it out if they have something. You know something's in the works, especially if they have, you know, Overwatch. But this was one of the bigger kits um, from Overwatch. Yeah, this is of course Bastion. If I remember. this kit number seven five nine seven four, if you guys remember, we did a we did a review on it and it was pretty cool. But the thing is, is you know again some of these Lego sets you kind of forget about. And this was not a cheap set by any means. It was about six hundred pieces, and I think it was about six hundred or not six hundred dollars. What am I crazy? It was about sixty five dollars, seventy five dollars out the door. And now I see these things on sale for around forty, and I think I've seen a few sites listing them for about. 35 37 so that's a super good deal and there's a lot of pieces on here that i think are definitely usable and and kind of customizable especially some of these flat kind of finishing pieces here on the side i think are awesome but i feel like kind of the whole again the whole overwatch series just kind of got you know it pushed out there it was cool but you know other sets just kind of took it over and we did do if you guys remember some of the other smaller sets that came with like two of these right here. Let's pull this one over. You guys probably remember a lot of these smaller ones. These were a little bit cheaper than um, some of the bigger sets like the Bastion set there. And these ones are definitely cool. I mean, right? You, you can't go wrong, but it's just like, there's nothing special about these. So I don't know. I, I, you know, I feel like, okay, the Bastion, he's a great piece to stick on your desk to have, you know, kind of up to show off your Lego collection. I think he's cool. These smaller pieces, not so much. You guys know, well, you guys can't see it over there. We do have a lot of the ATSDs that we're going to do kind of a versus against. But I don't know. I just want to know what you guys think about kind of the Overwatch kind of larger sets here. I mean, are you, were you guys pumped about them? Are you guys still pumped about them? Or am I just kind of overthinking this, thinking, okay, yeah, you know, it, it's cool, but it's not a piece that, you know, you would probably just have sticking around. But I think this one is for sure a cool piece. It just, you know, you don't hear much about it now. Um, in these smaller ones, I definitely don't see a lot of these out there. It's it's usually the Ninjago, Ninjago sets and things like that. But I just wanted to touch base with some of the old you know sets that we pulled out of the vault before we go stick them up on our new shelving and things like that. Anyways, guys, let me know what you guys think. I am definitely curious on to hear your things. You guys, definitely subscribe too if you haven't already, right? We do a lot of different giveaways and we want you guys to get in on those. So definitely go subscribe and check us out. Click the bell icon. Thanks again, Fox fans.